Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today I've got the best UGR class up for Warzone right now This is the new SMG that did recently get added within the season 3 update and it's actually a really good SMG The time to kill is insane on this gun and I think you guys are really gonna like it if you haven't tried it already Quick before we do jump into the video though, if you are new around it, be sure to subscribe to channel notifications Turn on so if any more videos on the channel If you do enjoy it, smash the thumbs up and let me know your thoughts on this UGR class up in the comments below But let's jump straight into the gameplay Go on then He got wee wee done. No doubt. Enemy You're lucky, mate. I'm lucky. I've just pissed on all three of you. What do you mean I'm lucky, bro? What do you mean I'm lucky, my guy? I've got no plates, L. Yeah, you can do these ones really easy. Hey, jump down. Shots. Hold on one second, bro. Where's he gone? This kid's a little slithery, sneaky, sneaky snake. The kid just keeps getting away every time I go near one, him. One, maybe two bullets on me, and it was a GG for me. I want them plates. I want them pilates. Shots. They're going to be able to gift. Yeah, yeah, I know, Josh. It's kind of tempting me to move to YouTube streaming. Low key. Because of the following I've got on YouTube and like a lot of the people that watch me on YouTube would want me to stream on here, if that makes sense. Right, fair enough. Fair enough. Cheers, G. Hey man, there's one in tower. One in yes, sir, there's one in tower. Best believe it. You already know. It's your boy, Haroldinho. Oh, okay. Now we're talking. Harry's got bars. Yeah, me too, Ron, which is kind of why I'm debating switching early and getting on it before a lot of other people do it. Do you know what I mean? And because I have a following on YouTube, it's not like I'm starting from scratch. The only thing I won't, like, the only thing that I'll miss is the copyrighted music, but I'd quite happily sacrifice that for more growth. Do you know what I mean? I don't think anyone would, but... You're down in his falls for real. Uh, why is he streaming as good? I think I don't think it's bad, bro. I don't think it's bad, man. I don't. I. I don't know why a lot of people slate YouTube streaming. Um, it's definitely got a lot better from when I first started streaming on YouTube. That's for sure. Let me tell you that much. This is an L. It's also my Tombi frying, huh? 70% cut as well. Yeah, true, Ryan. I didn't even think about that, but true. I do like to earn the money that I actually make. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> it is always nice to earn the money that you make. Hold on, chat. Let me just lock in, try and win this game real quick, and then I'll um. I'm 
bro. Gassy fucked me, man. I wanted to stim, but my Gassy just absolutely destroyed me. So guys, as you were sitting in the gameplay, I was running the Automaton with the UGR. The Automaton is the last video up on my channel if you do want to go check that out. I uh, go double time, overkill, battle hard for my perks, throw a knife as the lethal and the stim as the tactical. For the first attachment on the UGR guys, we are going for the sound suppressor which is going to take us off the radar when we're shooting. It's going to increase the ADS speed, it's going to increase the bullet velocity and increase the sprint to fire speed on this gun. And also this SMG is really good at mid range due to the like really good bullet velocity, the lack of recoil and the fast time to kill. When it comes to the barrel, guys, I found that the 14.5 Liberator was the only one that had a decent time to kill, and it, all it does is increase the bullet velocity. However, these three other barrels, I just didn't really like how they felt at all, whereas the 14.5 Liberator felt really, really nice. It felt like it had a really good time to kill and was very, very accurate. For the stock, guys, we're going for the KGB Skeletal Stock, which increased the ADS firing movement speed. It's increased the aim walking movement speed, and it's also increased the sprint to fire time as well. For the underbarrel, with being a Cold War SMG, we are going for the Bruiser Grip to increase the movement speed and the hip fire accuracy of the gun. And for the magazine, guys, we're going for the only one that's there possible, the explosive one. This is going to make uh, the explosive impact. It's going to increase the ammo capacity, but also increase the effective damage range of the gun, allowing you to win those mid-range gunfights. But that was the best UGR class up, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. If you did, be sure to smash the comments up. Let me know your thoughts on this UGR, and let me know your thoughts on the gameplay. If you're new around here, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Notifications turn so if any more videos on the channel. If you did enjoy it, smash the thumbs up. I appreciate watching all the Have a great day, and we'll catch you on the next one in a bit. Peace.